A lunge is a classic move that really helps lean out and shape your leg muscles. But a lot of women do them wrong because they're not strong enough to do them. So put a hand on the ballet bar. Now you can do a beautiful lunge with an extension stretch and you don't have to be very strong to do this move. However, if you do it consistently, it will make you very strong. Good, eyes are up there. Reach and exhale. Good, eyes are up and tall. Good, there you go. Two. As you already know about squats and lateral lunges, here okay, our checkpoint. Our checkpoint is the same on the lunge. We want to see the femur and the kneecap and the big toe are always in alignment. So that knee is not collapsing in here, okay? But you gotta turn on that glute medius, turn on that butt muscle, and line up the knee, okay? Also, the knee should not be way out over the toe, okay? It's directly above the big toe, so you could drop a plumb line straight down. So now one of our great stretch moves is a triangle pose to a forward fold. Okay, we take this move out of ballet, and we ease it up just a little bit so you don't have to be as flexible as a ballerina to succeed in this move. So you'll inhale as you flow up and exhale as you flex forward. Inhale as you flow up and exhale as you flex forward. This move feels really good. It opens up entire meridian lines it opens your back and your leg muscles as well as the organs too. My clients all say how good they feel after they do this exercise. You want to keep both legs straight and they're the base of your triangle. Good, so everybody knows the classic squat. Okay. This time with the bar, you're going to sit your butt back a little farther than normal. So holding onto the bar helps you sit back. Good. The reason why you're sitting back is to allow the hip flexors to let go. Okay, they don't need to be holding on to balance you. Okay, because your hands are holding onto the bar. When you sit back farther, it's going to work the glutes and the hamstrings more. And these are the muscles that we really want to develop to help pull that leg back and slim out those hips. and take it up to toes. You can also go all the way up to toes, lengthen up the entire leg, inhale, pull down, Good. inhale, pull down, and exhale up. And you can see how deep Chris is getting in this squat. These are really hard to do, but they're not gonna make your legs bulky. They're going to slim your legs down because you're stretching, stretching down, and strengthening on the way back up. Okay, stretching down, Good, and strengthen on the way back up. Good, and let's zoom in for a close-up. Good, are you in? Yep. All right, great. Mechanics are the same as the lateral lunges. Basically, we're looking for your kneecap and your femur to be in directly in line with your big toe, okay? Most women are going to collapse the knees in naturally. Okay, and you want to keep rotating those knees out. Okay? Why don't you turn to me and do that squat and show with the knees collapsed in. Okay? So we're not collapsing the knees in. Okay, this is bad, bad technique. You want to keep the knees out and in line with the toes. Yeah, very nice. Good, do a few more there. And reach that arm forward here. Good, and then press it down as you come back up. Very nice. And you can do all this ballet bar work with one hand as well. Good, last one here. Good, and next exercise, up dog to down dog.